Savari Cup everyone. Good morning from beautiful and sunny Chiang Mai, Thailand. Unfortunately today we leave this beautiful city and we leave actually the north of Thailand and we start the road trip towards south. The final destination will be Phuket, Thailand. So we'll drive all the way from Chiang Mai down to Phuket, but it's gonna take a while. It's gonna be a long, relaxing road trip and we'll explore most of Thailand in the coming weeks. So I'll bring you along with me. The first step will be Sukhothai, the first original capital of Thailand, of the Sukhothai Kingdom. Many people think that the first capital of Thailand was Ayutthaya and then became Bangkok, but it was actually Sukhothai. So today we drive from Chiang Mai to Sukhothai. I'll bring you with me and I'll show you the historical park, which is amazing. I've been there two times, but I'm always happy to go back there. So let's start. All right, we just discovered we can actually get inside the park with the motorbike. Instead of the shuttle bus, you can just drive around with a motorbike. I like that. All right, so the ticket for me, foreigner Farang, it's 180 baht. For Ploy, so Thai people, is 90 baht, so half price. And to get inside with the motorcycle, so we can drive around the park, it's 50 baht. No, vedi ciò, 27. So we pay in total 320 baht. Let's check it out. So this is the Elephant Conservation Center. It's owned by the government and it's super big. It's such a big park with a bunch of activities all around here there are like elephant baiting now they're gonna have a show at 1 30. there is an elephant school there is a elephant hospital down there a bunch of activities so we'll uh, explore around a little bit Cap the poopoo, the elephant poopoo, to make the paper later on. Amazing. Blind, huh? Oh. So this one is blind. So this was the elephant bathing time and now all the elephants they move all the way up here and they're gonna do a show for us. You know these these elephants are very well treated. They go to school, they feed them, they're really taking care of them. It's not some really like heavy tourist attraction. It's a government park, they, they take good care of it. They have a hospital, they have a learning center as well. They try to spread knowledge also about elephants. So now we're gonna have the, the show. Oh, oh, they're following me. Here they come, getting ready for the show. these elephants they bring them to school already since they are very young when they're like babies and they teach them how to do these kind of things how to play music 
how to paint, how to do all these experiences. But they're teaching it in a very healthy way. They're not abused. Alright guys, this is all from this Elephant Conservation Center or Sanctuary as well. It was a nice visit, so let's continue now the road trip to Sukhothai. <laughs> Alright guys, we made it to Sukhothai after like 4 hours of driving right on time for sunset. We are pretty tired but we're gonna stay here only one night so we really want to catch the sunset in the historical park because it's so beautiful just to hang out in these ancient ruins and it's, uh, it's a magical place. Let's go inside. We just made it inside the Sukhothai Historical Park. This place is truly magical, especially during sunset. It's such a, an amazing time. We pay 100 baht. One, we pay 100 baht for me, foreigner, and 20 baht for ploy Thai. Not so bad, I would say, because it's it's a really nice place. This place is truly incredible. Let me know in the comments below if you have ever been here to Sukhothai. If not, put it on your list. It's, it's beautiful.
at a nice little room here in Sukhothai. It's like a wood, but it's uh, it's clean and modern. Little sofa here, and we just pay 700 baht per night, including breakfast. Not bad, not bad. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoy Sukhothai. It's one of my favorite places here in Thailand. I've been here probably already three times. This is my fourth time. And every time I truly enjoy this place, the ancient ruins, the feeling, the energy of this place, is just unbelievable. Especially if you come for sunset in the historical park, it's wow, it's super peaceful. Let me know in the comments below if you have ever been here to Sukhothai or you're planning to come. Now we continue our journey towards Phuket. The next stop will be Nakhon Sawan. I'm not sure if I will make a vlog there because I've been there a few times and there is not really much. It's a great city, but nothing unique, I will say. And then we'll continue to some nice location on the way south. So stay tuned. If you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe to my channel. Like this video if you want to support this channel. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.